Mayor Sarno and city officials are working on an emergency court order to upkeep the Vibra Hospital site in Springfield. 22 News reporter Kiara Smith has why it's important for properties to be taken care of. Well, Heath, this Vibra Hospital building has been vacant for some time, and the city of Springfield has filed a court order to ensure that the building gets cleaned up and boarded up to prevent any more people from going inside. Springfield's Vibra Hospital used to be a place where patients could get the care that they need. And after some failed attempts to secure additional funding and resources for the hospital, it closed down and has been vacant. And with school being out, city officials say high school children have been finding their way into the empty building, using it to do drugs, and some people have even been staying there. Springfield Mayor Sarno says that the owners of the hospital failed to maintain the property, which is now making it a public safety hazard. But why we're here was because the overgrowth the illegal dumping uh, that was occurring, the boarding securing that was done in a terrible fashion, allowing individuals to get in here, putting them in harm's way, but more importantly, putting my police department and fire department in harm's way. Springfield Fire Commissioner B.J. Calvi says there is at least $150,000 in damage done to the inside of the building. The fire alarm has been ripped off the wall. The sprinklers are currently shut off to the building. There's no water here. Uh, every fire extinguisher that was left behind was discharged inside the building. He says this could become an issue in the case of a fire where people could get trapped inside. This building is what we call a firefighter killer. There are so many hallways and levels and doors that are locked. According to Mayor Sarno, they have not been responding to the city's requests and the fines are now over $3,000. Springfield Police Superintendent Lawrence Akers says the hospital needs to be boarded up properly and that the city is trying to clean and board up the property to protect the community. I just don't want anyone to get hurt. I don't want the children to get hurt. We have people coming in here using it as a drug den. I don't want them to get hurt. I don't want my officers or a fire department going in and getting hurt. So I do think that this is something that really needs to be taken care of. And the city has been taking action on this. The hearing for this court order is set for next Friday. Working for you, Kiara Smith, 22 News.